Hey everyone, this is Kate Schwanky, and I have a new unboxing for you guys today. As you know, Toki Sweet and Toki Joy prints for the Toki Doki and Kanga Care collaboration came out last week, and I'm really excited. I unfortunately didn't order any Toki Joy, but I did order some Toki Sweet, and the first time I saw that print, I like fell in love with it. It's super cute, probably my dream print. Totally wish Jujubee would make this print because it is super cute. Um, so I was able to order two change pads in the Toki Sweet print from Babytown, um, and they're located in Arizona. And my friend Jen was so sweet, she heard that they had extra change pads in their store before anybody else knew about it. And she told me about it, and I was able to call in and order this before they sold out. So thank you, Jen. I'm so excited that I have these. She actually just got hers a couple days ago and was telling me all about how much she loved it. So that, of course, made me even more excited. So I'm going to go ahead and open my package here and kind of give you guys a first impression. I'm sure I'll absolutely love it because I fell in love with it, like I said, the second I saw it. So... All right, here we go. Already I can feel they're very soft. Oh my gosh, this print is so freaking adorable. Oh my gosh, this is so cute. Okay, first off, the fabric is very soft and smooth. It's not like Jujube fabric, so not totally sure how this would work out for customs work, which is actually why I bought these. Um, I wanted to have two so that I could make well, one I wanted to keep for myself just in case we had another child and this would be an adorable change pad. Um, the other one I wanted to use for maybe making a camera strap or a wallet um, from the Happy Hippo. So we'll see, but oh my gosh, these are so nice. Okay, um, I'm going to pull one out so that you guys can see real quick. Super cute. These were originally $19.99 from their store. This is what the packaging looked like. It says Toki Doki and Kanga Care. On the back here it says multi-use sheet saver for changing pad. So features are waterproof outer layer available in colors and prints. Um, they're absorbent, which is a, could be a good thing or a bad thing. <laughs> On a change pad, you don't really want something absorbent. Um, it says it's hypoallergenic, topped with a no-spill stay dry micro chamois. I think that's how it's pronounced. I think that's the top part here. It's oversized to be the perfect size, full coverage for baby to lay on, and the dimensions are 24 inches by 15 inches, if that helps you. You can use it as a changing pad, sheet saver for co-sleeping and nursing. That is a great idea. Car seat protector from wet clothing, great for knacky time. I don't know what that is. <laughs> and you can machine wash it, which is awesome. Tumble dry low, no fabric softener is used with this, and no dryer sheets. So that is just the care and uses for this change pad. It kind of worries me that they're absorbent though. I wouldn't want a change pad to be absorbent. <laughs> but oh my gosh, these are so soft. Oh, so, so soft. On the back is like a microfiber. Um, I can totally, this feels exactly like the way a cloth diaper would feel. Um, so if that kind of helps you, if you cloth diaper, Oh my gosh, this print is so, so cute. I'm gonna just take a minute here and just look at all the print because it is so, so cute. Love it. <laughs> all right, so I'm going to go ahead and show you guys just a real close up look at this print. And uh, that's pretty much it. I didn't really have anything else planned. <laughs> I just, I wanted to show you guys up close because this print is just so cute. It's vibrant and soft at the same time and I promise you, if you get this as a changing pad, your baby will be so cozy on it. It is super soft on the back here, and this fabric on the front is super cute. So I'm gonna go ahead and show you guys real close up. Okay, so this is the Toki Sweet print. As you can see, the print is actually pretty small, but I really, really like it, the green background that it has, and it's actually more of a little bit of a darker mint. Um, but I really, really like that. As you guys know, I love mint. It's one of my favorite colors, which is probably one of the reasons why I absolutely love this print. And I love that it has so much Donatella on it. This is not a problem. If you guys are going to make customs out of this material, you will have plenty of print placement options with this if you love Donatella as much as I do. So this is just pretty much what the print looks like. And I will zoom in on a couple of different Donatella character spots. Um, I just really, really love this print, and I'm sure you guys do too, because this, <laughs> this print sold out so fast. 
One of the things that I wanted to show you guys is just how big this change pad is and how it compares to a Be Prepared change pad from a Jujubee diaper bag. Okay, so this is the full size of the change pad. As I said before, this change pad is 24 inches by 15 inches. And I have a Jujubee change pad in Frosted Blossoms right here. And I will show you that this change pad here is actually bigger, which is amazing because the change pad in the Jujubee Be Prepared is actually really good size. So as you can see, it's actually a couple inches longer over here. And, but this one here is actually just a little bit wider. So I just wanted to show you guys this for size reference, that it is bigger, which is fabulous. So this is an up close look at this print. It's absolutely adorable. It features every donut character that Tokidoki has. And I love that. So I'm going to just go over some of the characters with you guys real quick. As you know, this is Donatella right here. She's got a cute little box of donuts. And this is actually, I think, the same character that they used on the Anna Malini print where she is feeding the giraffe. So that's really cute. Down here, you have Donatino. He's the little doggy that looks like donuts. <laughs> Super cute. You also have Dolce here. She's the little donut unicorn. Right up here, you have the little flower. His name is Sprinklets. You also have Donatella here with her little boyfriend. Super duper cute. I love that little picture of them. His name is Shambello. So yeah, that's just so cute. This print is absolutely adorable. And then you have the little kitty here. His name is Biscuitino. So you've got every character on here. Also, you've got um, Mozzarella here. She's so cute. I didn't even notice her until a little bit ago, um, but she's got her little cow outfit on and then she's got like all these different colors. It's so cute. <laughs> this print is adorable and I can see if I did cloth diaper I could totally see me getting this print for cloth diaper because it is so cute. But anyways I hope this video is helpful for you if you're thinking about getting whatever they have left. This print is super cute. It's like I said it's soft but it's also vibrant at the same time. Um, this fabric here I'm not totally sure if it'll work really great for customs, um, but I think it'll be great for my camera strap that I'm thinking about getting, and possibly would be good for my wallet that I'm thinking about getting made. Um, so that's pretty much all I have to say about this, but it's just super cute, and I wanted to do a video on it because I love this print so much. So I hope this video has been helpful for you. Thanks for watching!